La la yeah. la la wait till I give my money right oh. I had a dream I could buy my way to heaven when I Hey guys, this is NFL Man or Rock and Man 1. Thank you for your name. Uh, so I've been off a lot. Um, I'm trying to keep it really busy. But uh, this big topic today is the full panel of like two stuff that I came up with an uh, iPhone or iPhone touches. Um, to tell you guys that you do not want to update your iPhone or iPhone touch to the iPhone 1.2 software because it honestly unjailbreaks your iPhone and you cannot jailbreak on the full panel of iPhone 2 software. Um, so I do recommend that you uh, go ahead and downgrade back to 4.0.1.1. Um, I'm going to have a link in the description to a video. The man that I want to show me how to uh, downgrade back to 4.0.1.1. And I do recommend him for you because he did it. Showed me how it's safe and easy to get back to four point one point one and the jailbreak. So uh, just to update them, do not I uh, do not update to the four point one point two until they come out with another jailbreak. And when they do, most likely all these apps will be working on that software. And just to tell you, also all these videos I make is that all apps work on the other four. So, if anything, just leave a message or a comment and subscribe to the link below. So, today I'm going to show you an app called, well, not an app, but a tweak. A tweak called Icono Classic. Well, Icono Classic is, if you ever heard about it, it's a, it's a <coughs> tweak that lets you customize your home screen to whatever design on an own shape you want. So the icon of Plasm does it it makes you either have four rows, five rows, it pretty much customize your home screen. So I'm gonna show you how you install it and how it works. So, okay, first you're gonna to want to go into studio. Um I do recommend then you download this app if you're a big customizer like I am. I like to customize my iPhone every time. I don't like to keep it stagnant, always changing the things, or changing the icons. But uh, just a heads up, this app is paid. You need to pay for it. But if you do know the source links, you're getting this app, the tweak free. I do recommend you do it. But so far, I've been trying the other crack apps or tweaks for this iconoplasm and it still doesn't work. So I suggest you can either buy it or try to find a source link to get it free. But I bought it and this is how you're going to get it. So you're going to go to the search bar and type in iconoplasm. Of course it's right there. Okay. This is the one that you pay for. But then you can see that I had links for the free ones, but it didn't work for me. So I had to download the paper. First, you want to go into an app. And when you first try to buy this tweak, it's going to say purchase, and it is $3. $3 is not that bad if you want to customize, and I want to customize my thing. So I did buy it and it's worth it. So after you bought it, it's going to not appear on the home screen, but it's going to be screen your iPhone or iPad touch. So what you're going to do is, we're going to go into, if you get something on here, we're going to go into settings. <coughs> and after you go into settings, you're going to scroll down through and you're going to see, and there it is, icon of glasses. So you're going to tap that, and there it is. You're going to enable your iconoplasm, and you see that my layout is a 5x5. Or, if you want, you know, they, they, you like to customize it, why have 5x5? Why well, don't have 6x7? I don't know. But you can enable here, 
and you can change the rules by putting, I don't know, 2x2, 3x3, 3x2, 4x5. I did change it, but I like it at 5x5 five, five because it gives me more space. But if you can see, I'll show you the layouts. There is the layouts, the original 5x4. There is a system default 4x4. Four four, or there is the dance 5x2. Or you can do a triangle. Triangle is pretty nice. I'm not going to show you here, but I do recommend if you like different designs, you can either go into these default ones or you can create your own over here. And after you enable either way, you can appear or enable your own design. You automatically tap this. It says apply changes in spring. It's automatically going to spring your iPhone. And uh, it's going to come back to the home screen. And it's going to be how you want it. So that's iPhone Cloud. Um, if you guys have any questions, just leave your comments. And please subscribe. And then go in below. And like I said, if you guys have any comments, just send me a message. And this is another video from iPhone Man or Apple Man Thank you. La la yeah. la la wait till I get my money right